As the government beefs up its defense on crime, tourism officials are doing all they can to ensure that the tourism industry does not falter. Minister of Tourism Obi Wilchcom addressed the issue today with Arjun and Noel Ferguson. The Ministry of Tourism set out an ambitious goal earlier this year, 8 million visitors by the end of 2014. But can that goal still be achieved as the country's tourism sector has been challenged with many issues that had the potential of crippling the tourism industry? There was the shooting death of U.S. visitor Carl Bruner, concerns of juvenile male prostitution at tourist hotspots, the Miami Cuban protests against the Bahamas, and most recently, a letter to Carnival cruise passengers from its operators warning them of the overarching issues of crime itself in New Providence. While Minister of Tourism Obi Wilshkom says this recent matter is now being addressed. The FCCA uh, meets uh, later this month in Colombia. We have a delegation there to talk with them. Uh, obviously, we want to show them the moves that we're making. It is our responsibility to uh, ensure uh, that such letters do not appear, and that is predicated upon the work we do. And so what the Commissioner of Police and what the Minister has done now is in response, and I believe it's going to help us take us a long way in getting beyond this point. So when we go to Colombia at the end of the month, we'll be expressing to them what efforts, what steps we're making, not only uh, for that, but also uh, how we're improving the uh, entire Welcome Festival place. Meanwhile, Senator John Boswick also raised concerns that Carnival might consider rerouting passengers to Black Bear at Key instead of the Capitol because of the criminal element. Wilshkom says while this may be extreme as Carnival has been loyal to the Bahamas, it is something to think about. To think that Carnival would do something like that, I, I don't think so. Uh, but the minister, but the senator has raised it. Obviously, um, he has an opinion. But I believe that Carnival has shown us over the many years that they've been good stewards to the Bahamas. Now, despite all that has happened this year, Wilshkom says there's been no major fallout in numbers so far, and he is convinced that the eight million visitor target will still be reached. Sometimes a crisis creates opportunity, uh, and we do have to fix some things in our destination. Product is fundamentally important. And so we have to look at all the concerns. I believe that the issues that we have in our country are solvable. Uh, we can fix it. Uh, we just have to have the will to do so. And although this may be a seemingly tough year for tourism, Wilshkom says that the year 2014 next year will definitely be a turnaround. Janae Noel Ferguson, ZNS Network News.